Hello, Victor here, RestoringMercedes.com. This video is for Eric in New York. Okay, Eric, so here's your car here. I just wanted to see what's with the ticking because I thought it's hydraulic lifter, but it's actually worse, unfortunately. So, the cam lobes. This is the lobe. This is what pushes. Uh, it's like a lever pushes on the lift um, the rocker actually it's called the rocker it pushes onto the valve right here these things see this is the rocker so now the camshaft supposed to have sort of like a rounder surface and it's supposed to be super smooth like a mirror now as we look here this is by any means not try to shut down the light so it does not and you can also see at the edges here there's some sort of scoring pretty bad scoring the same story I believe happens here and the reason why I even went there you see the same thing it's like eaten uh, eaten up it's like you see the actual line where it's been eating like right right down there it's like a groove to the edge to the right I don't know if the camera picks it up, it should. It's like a groove in there. And that's what happened. The camshaft went bad. And most likely because of that oil, you've been using very thin oil. <sighs> yeah. So this is basically piece missing. So where you see this edge right there, right up here, this sharp edge, it's supposed to be more metal. So this is basically sort of a combination of these cars, unfortunately. Let's look at rockers. <clears throat> the um, I was gonna check the lifters a little bit more just to see if I can, you know, if the lifters are okay. But they apparently are as hard as a rock, which is good. That's how it's supposed to be. There is no play in them, so I, you know, no no point really changing lifters if they're good. These are. The actual surfaces, they're badly scored. You can see chunks are missing right here. And these are all scraped and scratched and not smooth. So basically at this point, actually, you know what? This could have actually explained our shaking in the engine. That vibration was coming through the engine because of wrong timing. Because a valve I would open slower then injector would open up it's 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 a mess um let me see let me see if i can show you a decent lobe um, okay well let's just look at this one right here as you can see this one is not ticking it's very smooth everything is good with it like right there and it's like round it's not like it's not abnormal it has a little bit of a curve to it yes but it is more rounder than the one that you have this is the intake valve exhaust valve it's the intake valve this is exhaust valve but again i mean at this point the rockers and the camshaft to be replaced first thing bearing caps i'm not sure I'm not a motor man. I'm not, you know, not the motor rebuilder. It doesn't seem to be super difficult, but again, I'm not the engine guy. I ran this car with covers off, with covers being off, just to listen where's the noise coming from exactly, which lifter. And it, it turned out to be that this one was coming loud and this one was coming very, like, sort of just a little bit actually I would say this one was the loudest from this area so I figured okay this lifter possibly this lifter but usually lifter go on the exhaust side and here we got the intake side oh well so I just wanted to document this just to show you this video and then we'll decide what we do further because the engine as you can see it is very very clean <clears throat> very very clean I mean I'm so bummed that this happened really because this is clean 
for the mileage and for the year this is 1988 but the camshafts you can google that they had this, some sort of like a soft steel camshaft in these cars and therefore the tech that could explain the shake again that's what i'm saying the shake was very bothering me because the engine had this vibration on idle very abnormal for these engines this they're very smooth engines they should be really really good but um in this case not so good all right i'll talk to you possibly well i thought it's gonna be it's gonna be a guy here coming over but yeah so this is it i mean i will talk over the phone about what we're gonna do with this unfortunately i can't see any kind of lobe that i could show you this is the only one that i already showed you this one right here this one right here you can see nice round smooth no grooves a little bit of scoring but expected at the miles let me give you another shot from this angle here clearly we have crazy wear on the surface here crazy wear so even the one next to it as you can see is so much more rounder that lobe right there this one is forget about it <clears throat> all right so i'll cut it quits i'll talk to you on the phone we'll see what we're gonna do with this all right victor here is storymercedes.com thank you for watching